Hi everyone. Today we will learn how to use return key code to send data frame to serial port or PLC, so that PLC will respond and do the job accordingly. Firstly, we must know what is D1 data frame. Here is its format. Our OS system regulates that every data frame should start with 5A A5. And the third byte is the number of bytes of data behind it. A2 is write comment. A3 is read comment. 0000 to FFFF is VP address. The following is data. Details you can view our guidelines. Last video, we have generated a CFG file that applied the auto data plotting function. Here in the tool, we also need to take data auto uploading. In this way, data frame will successfully be uploaded to serial port simulator. Let's download the D1 set to display. If you have already downloaded once and want to update the touch and display file, you will only need to download them to display. Okay. Here is a serial communicating simulator. When I press the button, the simulator will automatically receive a data frame 5A A5 06. Eight three one zero zero one zero one zero 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 one. Eight three is read comment. One zero zero one is VP address. Zero one is one word length data. Zero 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 one is data. Okay, thanks for watching.